Hello everybody, Charlie you know, this is going to be a 2018 recording of how to set up the LOL recording for League of Legends setup for, of course, League of Legends in general. We're not going to do it this way, we're going to do it the way like this. Which shows the actual League of Legends menu and in-game capture. I've been trying to find a thing on how to do it, but this is going to be how to way. So we're going to use this to show what's going to be on my display for another OBS to see and how to do it. So we're going to make a scene which is plus, doesn't matter on the name, you could type it League of Legends Record and do a window capture. Press OK, you can name it to whatever you want but you gotta get this thing out for brief measure so this can work. You're going to remove this Add window capture and then it'll pop up because you need this to pop up first and then you click back onto here and it'll show the game right here and you can actually click it click the edge to make it max zoom so you can fill up the screen and you, you can actually see the game now so press ok and there you go you can name it window capture for thing and this will be your lol menu and as you can see you can move around, look at characters, whatever you want, and you can see that it's playing. That's that's really great. But the other problem is this. When you play a game, it's going to give you another screen. So what you want to do is not choose blind pick in that. Don't do it. Don't be that one guy who just does his tutorial on learning to do it. Just go on just go in the goddamn thing. Decline that. I don't want to do this yet. Go into the play. Go to training. Practice tool. Confirm it. Start game. And when you start it, you'll be in this screen and it's still combined with the menu. So that's good. And then you pretty much. Whoops. Not do that. Go back here. Pretty much choose a character. Doesn't matter who you choose. Just get the character and start the match. Once you start it, it'll get ready. And this is what you do. Once the game starts, you're going to see this. You don't want to try display capture on this because it's more better in the other way. Or you could do display capture, it doesn't matter. But the reason why some people don't do display capture is because it will show everything. So if you are having another window or something that you're messing with they're gonna see your information which is why we don't want to do that so wait until this loads up to 100 and we'll do the thing because we don't have to go there and put game capture yet first because this messed me up greatly you first have to go into the actual settings of League of Legends and go to the game in general once you're in the game in general, you look at the things. Wait, no, it's interface. I believe. Once you're in the thing, it will show specific thing. Damn it. Yeah, video. Here it is. Never mind. We're going to video. And basically, you gotta put your thing not in full screen window. It has to be borderless. The reason why it will be easy to record and you'll see it. So, goddamn. Once you get escape off the thing, you would add game capture onto your thing, capture a specific window, and go to the League of Legends TM client? No. Yeah, TM client. And there you go. You'll see yourself messing with it, and it's in borderless, meaning, as you can see, you could see it playing. If you do it just game capture, and then you keep it at its full screen when you go back to look at your recording it'll show it's not moving at all and I've been frustrated with that a lot or it been a black screen and the reason why was because it wasn't borderless so when you get off the game the game actually is paused for you and no one can see what you do but pretty much that is basically how you do League of Legends recording 2018 that that's pretty much it if you also have a low voice and can't talk for jack shite, you have the volume mixers here that can increase your volume or lower it. And to increase it, 
to increase it, it will be like that. If you have a low voice, which I do too, and I have my friend who plays League of Legends with me. We're going to keep it this way because I just learned this. And yeah, it will keep the thing more fine. If you have the desktop audio, you can measure it where you can speak while the game is also in the thing. But since my desktop audio is not on here, I use my headset. Is the reason why it's different. Also, for the League of Legends recording, if you haven't noticed, there is a output. And the output is basically all you need to know to start the thing. First, you don't need to mess with these yet, but you need to mess with this recording path. You browse it, make a folder, whatever you want, doesn't matter, new folder. Click on it, you select the folder, and that will be the folder where all your videos are. Which I chose my own videos folder, which is this folder, to get the videos. And I make other folders to put them in the videos, which is why, when you see it, I have a scroll actual championship I'm going to be champion, I'm going to do later on. Because I've played so much Scarl. What you also need to know is that you can do it MP4, but the problem about MP4 and MOV is that sometimes the recording is not that great. For example, MP4 can crash anytime without you knowing, which is a problem. And it would do it will give you this thing which tells you why. For another thing. But MOVE is something I kinda go with because I'm fine and then I can stop recording whenever I want. And it'll be handy dandy. As you guys can see, I'm still recording in MOV because YouTube it it refers to only getting MOVs or MP4. It cannot give a FLIV video. So if it's at FLIV, change it to MOV because FLIV actually you can't get the video onto the YouTube thing and then post it, and that will be pretty much it. That that this is just it for the lol recording. That's all. If you do. In case if you do want to do your live stream, go to your Twitch and YouTube, that'll be a separate video. Of course, get the key, show, find it, that, yeah. But I'll do the streaming for League of Legends a little later. For now, this is just recording. You also have the audio thing, so if you do have a bit different setup than mine, well, you can do that. For the uh, face cam, we'll do that a little later. But for now, this is just it for the low recording. See you guys. Goodbye. Uh, you can leave now. Just, just leave. No, no one wants to care. I don't care about this AFK warning. Bye.